St. Joseph Regional High School in Montvale, New Jersey, is a high school football powerhouse. But this week, the action was off the field, pitting a coach against a player's mother. CBS 2's Tony Aiello live in Montvale with more details tonight. Tony? Dana, it is the top ranked football program in New Jersey, one of the top 25 nationwide. The Green Knights of St. Joseph Regional even traveled all the way to Florida last week for a game. But when practice picked up on Tuesday, things got ugly between a parent and a coach. High emotion. I mean, I would just say foot, high school football in this area is, you know, fairly intense. The angry encounter reportedly happened Tuesday at the football field behind the Catholic school. According to NorthJersey.com, assistant football coach Christopher Trout told police he heard a player's mother arguing loudly with another coach. When he asked her to calm down, she got in his face screaming and spinning. She slapped him across the face with keys in her hand, and he pushed her away to protect himself. But the mother, Sharon Hardy, says the coach spitted her. She smacked him in the head with an open palm, and he retaliated by punching her and knocking her to the ground. Both versions disappointing but not surprising to this retired school teacher. Because parents sometimes get overwhelmed and they're very passionate about their kids and they want to protect their kids but also find the coaches are sometimes a little too aggressive toward the children so it gets me upset to think that they can't work it out. I do have children and in sports and it was always something as for parents that you have to you know make sure you're in the right place and also for the coaches. Keep your emotions in check. Exactly. The St. Joe's athletic director released a brief statement. We had an altercation between two adults. Both parties are extremely embarrassed. Embarrassed and apologetic, according to the athletic director. Now, Montvale police took statements, but they will not pursue charges at the request of both the mom and the coach. Live in Bergen County, New Jersey, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Thank